Hey guys, so this tutorial is related to WSL not getting started or not opening in Windows operating system. So in this tutorial, we are going to solve this particular issue. So if you click on this WSL system, you can see a window got opened, but the actual WSL is not getting started. So in this tutorial, let's fix this particular issue. So for that, first of all, just open PowerShell in your Windows system and run it as admin okay so here you need to run few commands by which we can solve this wsl not opening issue so just enter this command okay so i will just provide all the commands in the description of this video so you can just check it out from there and copy paste from there so you can see there is no specific error been provided over here so you can see 100 percent completed 100 percent completed okay so that means that wsl is working perfectly fine so now next step is to restart the wsl so to restart you just need to set down okay so set down and check okay so if i run this uh, wsl command you can read this message it is saying that uh, no installed distribution windows system for linux has no installed distribution so it means that with wsl there is no operating system being installed so that is the reason the wsl is not starting okay so to solve this we must install any operating system like linux ubuntu or any other system so you can see it is providing the suggestion also over here so just enter this command to get all the list of operating system that uh, wsl uh, supports in our case we are going to install ubuntu so just get the names from here and run the second command so this command wsl.exe install and the system that you want to install so in our case i want to install ubuntu so i will just enter ubuntu over here so you can see downloading ubuntu so this might take some time so let's wait for some time to get ubuntu system downloaded in wsl okay so downloading got completed so it is installing so you can see over here distribution successfully installed okay so now you can run that particular operating system by using this command okay so now if i enter wsl it might give me some options or it will directly start because only one uh, distributing system is been installed in my uh, current operating system so here you can see so basically i am i have installed it latest so it is asking me a user account so i will just enter my name over here and password okay so i will just enter my name okay same thing so now you can see we are successfully into a ubuntu system using uh within our windows operating system so you can just play with ubuntu system from here okay so now let me check if this is working so now you can see even this is working so from here also we can start that particular uh, ubuntu system okay so that's all for this video tutorial thanks for watching please do subscribe protocol as point thank you